another reason disability is physically and mentally exhausting. As some of you know, I went to London yesterday to speak on a disability panel and I stayed in a really lovely wheelchair accessible hotel. When I get there, the entrance to the hotel has stairs, but they melted away and turned into a lift in a second. Look at this. Whee. But coming down in the morning, ready to go onto my panel, need to be there on time, obviously. Just could not get it to work and he had not been trained to use it. He did inform us that his manager will be back in about 10, 15 minutes. I didn't have the luxury of 10, 15 minutes. Disabled people work too. We need to get out of the building. Luckily, I had Sean with me who could bump me down the stairs. But if that wasn't the case, I would have had to have waited and I would have been late. And don't even get me started on trying to hail down a cab. With the thanks to Sean, I was there on time. It's little things like this that just make it exhausting.